down, they finished in sixth place. We'll come back with more to wrap up the afternoon in Skate Canada in St. John, New Brunswick. Despite the critics, he is and always will be an Olympic gold medalist. At Skate Canada, Ermanov has had nothing less than a champion's form. He's trying to win over his harshest critics, the Canadian public. So far, Alexei Ermanov has enlightened everyone who has watched him in this maritime city. Scott Davis has also made some believers. The two-time American champion leaped into second after the short program. Israel's Michael Schmerkin was second in 1994. He'd like to improve on that standing. Also tonight, Shaylin Bourne tries to escape the pain of her injured knee. Braving her way through the compulsories, Shaylin and Victor Kratz emerged in first place. Her battle continues in the original dance. Welcome to day three of the Sun Life Skate Canada International. I'm Rob Falls. You know how hard it is to get the studio audience to applaud on cue like that? Thanks, guys. Checks in the mail. We've got a great show for you tonight, and not bad for Canada in the first couple of days. A couple of third-place finishes. Jose Schwinard in the women's free program last night. And Jodine Higgins and Sean Rice took third in the pairs program. This evening, we will have the original dance of Shaylin Bourne and Victor Kratz and the entire men's free program and get Alexei Urmanov at Skate Canada to already impressive credentials. To get an idea of exactly what might happen tonight, let us join the people who will describe all the action for you, Barb Underhill and Dan Matheson. The talk for the last few days, of course, the injury that Shaylin has on her knee, the 17 stitches, it can't be bandaged, apparently. She's not going to shoot it up, so she just has to deal with it. She's tough as nails, and you know, this <laughs> happened 10 seconds before the end of the very last practice, last Friday. They said everything was going along so well, and then this happened. But they've arrived here, and day by day, little by little, she's getting a little bit more and more motion in the knee, and today in practice, she said that she couldn't have done what she's doing today. She couldn't have done that yesterday. Mm -hmm. So little by little, she's getting a little bit better. So she's looking better. I wonder how it preys on Victor's mind, too, because he has to be thinking maybe he has to take a little extra special care with it. Yeah, and he's really feeling bad about the slash. I mean, these things happen all the time, and, and you can't worry about that. I mean, she certainly doesn't blame him, but he, you know, I can tell he's feeling bad about it. <laughs> You're going to enjoy their performance. I'm sure you will. Born and Kratz ready to go. As you can see, we have our souvenirs of St. John. No snow here tonight, just some terrific skating. Stay with us. We have dance in the men's free skate from Harbor Station.